people tend to love this game. People tend to hate this game. I don't understand why. Um, I think this game is absolutely phenomenal. This is Sonic Superstars, God. And this is my quick, I guess you give me impressions and v or a review of it, whatever you want to call it. Um, I don't, I, I would just say this. I like the game. I mean, I don't, I understand people want to critique the game and give it the issues and its problems or some people actually like it for the pat fast pace or the co-op is kind of wonky, but hey, l let me tell you something. Me and my son have been playing this game and my son loves Sonic and Mario. And in this, you know, in this video, you're going to see him playing as Sonic, I'm Knuckles, and we're just having a blast. My wife even comes in and plays. She plays as Amy. All three of us get on the screen and it's a blast. And you want to know something? The main thing about this game is if you are a kid, and I, I, I'm just be honest, if you're a kid and you like Sonic, this game is for you. And if you're a parent with kids, this game is for you. Because see, you can actually play this game with your son or daughter who loves Sonic or Amy or Knuckles or Tails or whatever it can be. Like all of them and um, play and you guys will have a phenomenal time. Um, one thing I do like about this, even though that the game is a little wonky on the co-op side, you don't necessarily die because you're getting left behind or anything like that or you're going too far ahead it it is times that you will pass you will die because of that but other than that most of the time it is you know straightforward somebody gets ahead press the x button you're right along with them and that helps a lot because my son likes to explore while he's while we're running or he likes to run ahead and we just sit there and we will just politely just tap the button and we'll be right right back with him and it's not necessarily a bad thing where we get frustrated because one thing and don't get me wrong i love mario 3d world i love super mario on uh on the wii u deluxe i love all those games and we play that with my son as well but the thing about that is you, if you get left behind you lose a life and that kind of that really kind of sucks sonic sonic superstars kind of got rid of that or they found a way to um you know kurt tell that so it won't be an issue um because like i said mario 3d world i mean i love the game but that game is notorious for ruining games if you get left behind but this game is great i think we're just about done with the game uh we're probably about at the end of the game we've been playing it all weekend and this game has done nothing but put a smile on all of our faces you see the bonus round right here reminiscent to the old sonic games um this game has a little bit of everything for everybody and um all, everybody got different traits that work like amy could double jump you know uh, knuckles can float sonic is fast and i think you know tails basically you know you know what he does he flies with his tails with <laughs> tails <laughs> but you know what i mean um it, 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 it pretty much works out I've seen a lot of people give this game a bad rap, like, you know, some people love it, some people hate it, but the ones who give it a bad rap, it, it kind of gives it for some of the weird reasons, like, like I said, the, the co-op is not necessarily intuitive, or, you know, the game is not what the other Sonics used to be, or whatever the case may be, but, you know, I know something, as much as I love Sonic Mania, and I think, you know, Sonic Mania, you know, I, I like that game a lot, but I think for the most part, it kind of stuck a little bit too much, you know, close to the original. This game has a lot of new and different type of uh, areas that you can go to. Totally different scenes, so totally different zones, and it's it's very refreshing. I think Sonic, and I think the Son the, the people who made this game for Sega, I think they done a great job of really revitalizing sonic now don't get me wrong i think sonic was done well with sonic mania and i don't necessarily want to um try to you know compare the two but i really feel that they've done a really good job with this one where it is when it feels fresh i think sonic mania did feel a little felt like you played it already it, it kind of felt like a, a sonic i ain't gonna say a sonic hack or whatever but it's all it felt like a sonic rom at some time but they, you know they did have new stuff there too but nevertheless superstars i highly recommend buying this game especially if you have younger um children like i can say like anywhere between four and in in ten i think they will love this i mean the the aesthetics the graphics look great they look absolutely great on h in hdr um I, it just looks good it has a much of a, a more of a 
cartoonish kitty feel instead of the uh what you call it the sprites it just feels a lot better i mean i ain't gonna say feel a lot better but it just looks a lot better on the eyes than the original you know uh sonic that we're used to because i mean don't get me wrong that those don't look bad either especially when you use the the crt filters but just to have a more updated sonic like this i think this is the type of stuff that you know that what sonic generations tried to do and uh not only that um you had some other sonic uh mods that like sonic 2 hd or you know all these other games tried to pull off and i think that sonic i think sonic superstar did a great job i i feel that the way this is going i could see a sequel to this i really would love to see a sequel with mighty and ray i think that would be absolutely phenomenal because i, I think with the way these levels are designed that's probably like the only knock i can say about this game the the only knock i really have on this game is that you really can see that they could use ray in this game with the way with his abilities they would have been great for this game if ray was on it because there's a lot of platforming and some of the platforming is kind of uh you know high and you know and um they're kind of you know hard to get to in some places um uh, if you have knuckles in some cases you're gonna have problems jumping because knuckles glide so much sometimes he feel like he doesn't jump high enough but uh other than that he uses the strengths you know differently than others like i said all of them have different abilities that really works in their favor um but if you have somebody like amy amy could double jump so that helps out a lot and i noticed that like my wife she complained about she complained about uh amy jumping too high or jumping too far and i'm sitting here with knuckles like i can't you know get where i want to get in most cases but sonic my, my son i mean he, he plays with sonic and he loves everything about it and he does very well with you know this game so i i really think for the most part if you're really looking for a game a sonic game you want to feel a little bit of nostalgia you want to uh go in and uh play a game with your um with your kids i think this is a good one to do so i think you will be pleasantly surprised this game is fun like i said we, we bought it this weekend pretty much about done with the game already uh and it is is just a testament to how much fun you can have uh, you know co-op with the family and uh this is uh one of those games absolutely i'm i'm already gonna go buy uh mario uh, wonder super mario wonder is the next one i'm gonna buy uh, hopefully it's, it doesn't suffer from like uh, what Mario 3D World or Mario on the Wii uh, Mario U Deluxe uh, pretty much suffer from I don't think it will from what I've seen and I don't even think they have lives in that game which is pretty interesting but um, it, it, it's going to be really cool I, I can't wait to see how that plays out so I'm going to get out of here if you like this video please let me know hit the like button share this video what do you guys think about Sonic Superstars I think the co-op in this game actually brings it brings the game out more obviously you could play this solo and playing this solo you're gonna you know you're gonna have a blast with this as well but i think you know for kids and you know how kids do some kids especially younger kids want you to play with them this is a game for you and your son or daughter especially if they're around the four to eight year old range you know i, I think it's great it's fantastic well i'm gonna get out of here I think i said enough you know i could talk my head off if need be and i'm probably sure you guys don't want to hear me talk all day so i'll see you guys in the next one all right y'all y'all take it easy and uh y'all be blessed peace